What? What am I doing back in London? Oh, I know you guys weren't fooled by the absolutely pristine telephone booth behind me. This is a joke, right? We're all laughing at this. I hope you're all laughing at this. If you're not, then you need to watch more of my videos. Especially the one where I rant about these telephone booths that were a big disappointment. <laughs> yep, actually today I am at Epcot. I'm traveling the World Showcase with my little Duffy Bear. I'll tell you more about him later in the video. Just thought I'd get some ha-has in. <laughs> oh, the Mickey ears are out. That must mean it's my day off again. Guess where we are today? We're gonna go adventure around Epcot for a little bit. Not for the whole day though. I'm gonna try to meet Baymax if possible and do lots of other fun things here. Just kind of wander around, enjoy the World Showcase, maybe some rides, and then later today I'm going to Hollywood Studios. I've got some fast passes for there I need to use, some people who are working that I need to bother, <laughs> and general funness to ensue. I just met Baymax. I'll put a picture in the video. However, I was not able to get the video of me meeting Baymax. There is a short video of Baymax though. Yay! He's pretty cool to meet. Kind of a short meet and greet though. There was a long line. Anyway, I'm actually headed to... Uh, I took a wrong turn. I went to Starbucks. Ha! I'm headed to Club Cool. I'm gonna go try sodas because I can. Club Cool, if you don't know what it is, is the Coca-Cola place in Epcot where you can sample different flavors of soda from all around the world. And it's pretty awesome and all of them are delicious, especially the Beverly. Definitely try the Beverly. much all the flavors at Club Cool except for, well, you'll find out. <laughs> but they're all pretty good and there are other places all over Disney World where you can order some of those flavors in full glasses. For example, at Animal Kingdom in Harambe Market you can get one or two of the flavors I'm forgetting right now but they're delicious. Anyway, that's a fun thing to do. I'm gonna move on to the World Showcase now and do some more things that I came here for. Epcot is currently also preparing for their, is it Festival of Flowers? Is that what it's called? It's a big garden festival in March and they have lots of pretty stuff out. They're preparing for it so they have lots of cool things up like this around the park. But I'm going to come back a different day when that festival is actually ongoing to film all those things for you. So if you see one in the background, not to fret, that is an adventure for a different day. Thank you. 
So I'm gonna introduce you guys to another fun activity you can do at Epcot. It's called Kid Cot. This is Duffy. Ah, say hi to Duffy. Duffy is Mickey's bear that he takes around the world with him. He's a cute little guy. I know you can meet him here at Epcot as well. That's just a side note. Anyway, you can get these little Duffies. I got mine over in Canada, but I'm sure there's other places you can start. But Canada is kind of one of the entrances to the World Showcase, so it's a good place. And basically, on the back of Duffy, everywhere you go, all the countries will give you a new little stamp on the back of Duffy and draw you a cute little picture. And that's adorable. And you can collect all these pictures and even sometimes your name written in other languages on your Duffy. Also, if you notice, he's kind of gray and white or black and white. You can color him in and they have coloring stations everywhere and that's fantastic. But I'm gonna color mine later to save myself some time. But this is my Duffy and he's traveling with me today. That is Kit Cot. I'll show you later. That's the most European thing here. Oh. Although I suppose there is a pub and fish and chips. Duffy's been to England now, just like Hannah has. Ha! Ah. Looking in the stores here actually does make me quite sad and make me miss London quite a lot. Because they actually do have lots of things here that are, um, what's the word, not unique, kind of like specific to location. Ooh, the word, the vocabs, it's not happening today. But, oh, I'm sad, but I'm happy. But now, Duffy's traveled. They have little pictures they can draw on the back, and um, there's actually different pictures, and they'll draw different ones. A little kid before me got a little palace guard and I got a little flag. Oh. So it's a lot of fun, really. Duffy has visited France now. Oh. Here in France, one thing I recommend that I have tried, haven't tried much here, but this ice cream syrup. I'll butcher the name. Baratissan de Glaces. That was probably horrible. I am so sorry. But it's amazing. They have all kinds of flavors of gelato ice cream and it's fantastic. Oh, you have to try it. Anyway, that's my recommendation for France. I'm gonna try to hang around for a little bit because I kind of really, really, really want to meet Belle and she's supposed to be out soon. But we'll see how that goes. I did get to meet Belle and she was wonderful and she invited me to her library to give her book suggestions and to read together. Oh, I love her so much. She's my favorite. Anyway, we're in Morocco now. Um, I'll put a picture of me with Belle after this little clip and then I'll show you Duffy getting his little stamp in Morocco. Thank you.
We've been to Japan now. We're gonna have to speed things up a little bit because I'm meeting a friend, my friend, roommate, Jill, whatever, Jill. <laughs> I'm meeting her over at Hollywood Studios, so I'm gonna have to hurry it up a little bit. Oh, look at that, we made it to America. Nobody cares, America. Nobody. I don't. But I live here, so that's just me. Oh well, we still have to make our kid cot fun stop for Duffy. So Duffy can say he's been to America. Well, Duffy has now been to America. Also, we Americans are very self-centered. So the USA stamp goes on the front, unlike the other stamps. Come on, America. I guess I kind of get it though, because technically, yeah, Disney World is in America. You know, Disney World, I guess. Okay, fine. I guess I get it, but really? Oh well, they gave me this cute little American flag with a little Mickey. Ah! All right, off to our next place, bye! Duffy's been to Germany now. He's got a little German flag to prove it. Yep. Sorry this is going a little bit faster now, but I kind of need it to at the moment. We have more adventures ahead for today. have performers all over the world around here and they also have themed meet and greets I don't know if you can see him back there but there is Donald there's three caballeros Donald too which is pretty cool um, yeah everything's themed around here but they have lots of those entertainers that come out all kinds of times throughout the day really cool to watch yeah, and now we're at our last stop for Kid Cot in Mexico before I ditch this place and get to Hollywood Studios. Hello. Hi. Thank you. You're welcome. Duffy is complete. We've been to Mexico now. Yay, Duffy's a world traveler just like Hannah. Except Duffy's been a lot more places than Hannah has. <laughs> there we go, that's what he looks like when he's all finished. 
except you might have different pictures or different symbols because some of them write their names like I said and there's also different types of pictures they can draw on the back but the stamps will be roughly the same that was really fun so now we're gonna head out of Epcot had a fun half day here by myself but I'm ready to make a friend so Jill and I are heading over to Hollywood Studios. I got some fast passes for some rides. We're gonna have a good old time. We're gonna try to bother some people that we know that work there. <laughs> not like actually bother. Like if anyone important is watching this video, I promise I'm not like interrupting their workspace. I'm basically going to smile at them and wave and be like, ha, I'm on a day off. <laughs> anyway. <sighs> I'm also really happy though. I inspired a little girl to do this Duffy thing. I was standing in line to meet Belle and this lovely mother and her daughter were standing behind me and this little girl goes, where'd she get that bear? So she asked me and I told her all about the Kid Cot thing and then I saw them later in another shop around the world working on their bear with their stamps and their photos and she was having so much fun with it. I feel so good about that. I love when I can make people's day around here by telling them about all these little things that not everybody knows about that are really fun to do. Anyway. Bye for now from Epcot.